Hey guys, so today I'm doing a makeup tutorial. Um, it took me a while to figure out which one I wanted to do. I'm planning on doing a lot more makeup tutorials now, but the one I'm going to do today that I've decided on is um, I'm going to call it a metallic sheen look. Um, I'm using all metallics. Um, and it's going to be a really simple, um, fast and easy look. So we'll go ahead and get started so this video doesn't take forever. I'm going to go ahead and pin my hair back. Um, now to prime your eyes, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer in Eden. Just so I can, um, you know, I said that I didn't really like this product. But I don't like to waste. So we'll go ahead, you know, I'll continue to use it. And for your face look, you're going to want a really matte look. Um, you know, I just have on my foundation. I don't have any blush on. Um, I put a little bit of bronzer on to contour, but that's about it. Um, so yeah, add that on. And then what you're gonna do next is I'm taking both of my jumbo eye pencils from NYX. Um, in milks and pot and pan, pots and pans. I'm using the milk on the most part of my eye and then the pots and pan on the outer corner. You will see why, um, you know, as we get started. You know, my computer's getting hot. I just don't want it to turn off in the middle of this thing, but okay. So you're going to take your jumbo eye pencil and milk and take it and just put it on there. I love this eye pencil, it just makes my eyeshadow so vibrant. And also draw it into the inner corner of your eyes. Because you're going to be putting eyeshadow in there. So then you're going to rub that in. So it's not too crazy white. And then you're going to take um, it in pots and pans and you're just going to put it on the outer corner of your eye. Just like this. So just a little bit. And then you're going to blend that out just like you did with the milk. There's not going to be a lot on there, you just want it on there. All right. And then, the palette that I'm using, this is all the eyeshadows that I'm using. As I did this in a haul the other day, I got it from Rite Aid. It's GOV, I believe. Um, it doesn't have a name of like what it is, but it's all these gorgeous metallic um, eyeshadows in there. So it's really, really pretty. The first color we're going to be using, oh wait, I think I grabbed the wrong one. Oh yeah, we're actually using this palette with the lighter pastel colors. And the first color that we're using is we're going to blend this gold and this gold together. This is more of a coppery gold and then this is the light yellow, but we're just going to blend those together. <laughs> to create a gorgeous gold color. Um, you're going to be using your e.l.f. Professional Eyeshadow Brush. That's what I'm using. So just take that, tap that into the color. I blend them together really nicely. And then you're going to put that on the inner two-thirds of your eye and in the um, inner corner. So you're just going to tap that on. And you're going to have to add, like, more color. Like, you're going to have to go back and put more on just because, um, that if you want, you know, good color, that's what you're going to have to do. And then, they'll, like, you'll use it as the highlighter in the inner corner of your eyes as well. And then you're just going to do the same to the other eye. All right. 
And then the next color, after I'm done doing this, we're going to be using is a really pretty pink color. Give me just a second, I'll show you. The pink color that I'll be using is that pink right there. We're going to be putting that in the middle of our eyelid and just take that on. Um, I'm just going to use the other side of this brush and tap that in there and tap it onto the inner part. Like that's such a pretty salmon color. I'm just going to take tap that. And also with these colors, don't go like above the crease. And then you can start blending them out a little bit. So that pink, if you can see it, I still have to figure something out with my lighting because I feel like you still can't even see the colors, but you get the gist of what I'm saying. And again, you're just going to pat that on there. And I'll blend it a little bit. All right. And then <clears throat> the next brush that I'm going to be using is this is from Essence Beauty. And I'm going to be taking this like gun metal silver right here. And we're going to be putting that on the outer V of our eyes. And just use the one side of that because you're going to use another color to highlight. Just gonna take that and pat it right here. And actually, I'm not gonna make a V, you just want like a tiny, 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 tiny bit of color on the outer corner so that it looks like that. And you can blend it a little bit. And then we're just gonna do the same to the other eye, just pat it with that left, like where the leftover eye is. Or like piece of that, you know what I mean? All right. So now it looks like that. And then I'm going to take this other side of this essence brush and dip it in this light silvery color right here. And I'm going to use that to highlight my brow bone. So it's just a really super shimmery look, but it is gorgeous. And it's really not that hard at all. Um, you know, anybody could do it. And like this palette, it's really affordable. Like I said, I got it from um, Brady. So I think it was like $5.99. And then I'm just taking, you can take any fluffy, fluffy brush, but I'm using my blending shadow brush from Estee Lauder number 25. You're just going to take that and pat the colors together. So they are blended. Just like you would like with any other, just blending it together. Now, if you feel like you're losing color, you can go back and reapply. But I don't think I've lost any color. I'm happy with how it looks. And then I think I'm going to take really super fast. I'm going to just swing it on the outside, so I'm just going to use my Maybelline Stiletto and just really super fast. I'm going to wing it out. So start in the inner corner of your eye and we'll make it pretty, not super thick, but and then we're just going to wing it out a little bit. So just like that we'll do it to the other eye and then the only thing i have left to do is apply mascara and to show you what kind of lipstick to use so the video is almost done the hardest part is over just like that really simple and then you're going to take mascara the last thing you're going to do to your eyes take mascara I'm going to use my telescopic 
carbon, whatever, from Oriel. And I'm not going to curl my eyelashes today just because I don't want to waste time, but you can. Just put a couple coats on there. Make sure you always put on mascara afterwards, though, because it's always the final pop to the look. And then, as I finish this up, I just want to tell you about um, lipstick that you want to use. I'm using a nude pinky color. Um, it doesn't have to be pink. It can be whatever you like, but um, a nude color, or like a, uh, not a nude, a matte color would be the best for this look since your eyes are so shimmery. Um, like for your face, like I put a tiny bit of highlighter, but you have so much shimmer on your eyes that you really don't want that much, um, you know, shimmer. But my matte color that I'm using is Pink Pout from Revlon in 002. Just this really pretty pink color. And I'm not going to... I'm not going to put any lipstick or lip gloss on just because I want it to be super matte. So there is my look. Um, it takes, it's really not that long. Um, it's just because I'm sitting here trying to explain it to you. Um, but it's really simple and easy. And I really hope you guys like this video. Um, and I hope you try it out and let me know what you think. So thank you so much, guys. Comment and subscribe. All, as always, thank you. You have a great day. Bye.